Attention astronomy fans, the Perseid meteor shower is set to peak early next week. Meteorologist Nathan Gidley joins us with the details on what we may be able to see. Nathan? All right, get ready for the Perseids. This is what NASA calls the best meteor shower of the year just because of how active the meteors are going to be as they shoot across the sky. Well, it's going to reach its peak Sunday night into early Monday. Right now, we're currently forecasting partly cloudy skies, but to stay tuned all weekend long on that forecast. The best viewing is going to be after the moon sets, and our current moon phase is a half moon. So we'll keep an eye on those moon set times. We'll talk more about that in a moment. Dozens of meteors per hour are likely though. Now it's going to come in waves. Don't expect a grand show every second you're out there, but your best bet is to get away from the city lights. Let's take a look at what we're tracking here. That's this meteor shower is from the debris from the large comet Swift Tuttle. You generally want to look to the northeast sky, but again, those meteors are going to be shooting across the sky, potentially creating a grand show from time to time. The peak, though, is not the only viewing chance. Last year's Perseids lasted all the way from July 14th to September 1st, so you still have some time, but you'll have to get more lucky the further along we go into August. So again, the best meteor viewing will come after the moon sets. Here's a look at those moon set times. Saturday night, 1125. Sunday night during that peak is 1149. And then Monday night after the peak is 1218 a.m. So make sure you get on out and away from city lights after those times. We'll keep an eye on the forecast, but enjoy the display that is the Perseid meteor shower. Meteorologist Nathan Goodley, Wayne 15 News.